So have you ever gone to buy a pair of shoes and then the seller tells you the price is let's say 5,000 shillings. So you negotiate and the seller agrees to lower the price to 3,000. You go home feeling proud of the good bargain. But in essence, maybe the actual value of the shoes was 1,000 shillings, meaning you've paid 2,000 shillings more. These are cognitive bias known as the anchoring effect. This is where we rely too heavily on the first piece of information that we get. It becomes our anchor on which we base most of our decisions. This is something most sellers use. It's where they quote high prices so that the price that you end up paying seems like a good deal. Employers use it when they ask you during the interview questions, how much are you expecting as your salary? When you say 70K and then they give you 100K, you go home thinking this is the best company ever, but maybe their budget for that position was 150K. So ladies, let's say you want your guy to buy your car worth 1 million. Show him a car worth 1.5, tell him that's the one you want. Of course, he'll say that's too much, but you should look for a cheaper one. Then you end up getting the car worth 1 million, which is what you really wanted in the first place. The guy will think he's gotten a better deal, but you know you've used the anchoring effect to your advantage. Let me know if you've experienced the anchoring effect. Till next time, peace.